Hello friends, welcome back. Today I was supposed to be vlogging. Um, well, technically today you were supposed to get a vlog, but yesterday it took me about four and a half hours to grocery shop. And then by the time I got home, I was setting everything up for the grocery haul and my dog dug a hole under the fence and got out. So I was out looking for him until midnight. So when I got back, I just put up the cold stuff that I didn't put up in a rush and left everything else. So I just put it all back out for you. So here is our grocery haul. <laughs> so I have Walmart and Aldi as usual. I split it up, um, Walmart on this table, Aldi over here. And again, <laughs> this is for two households and for about two weeks each. I believe July, I want to say July 17th is the last time that I posted a grocery haul and it is now the 30th. And I went grocery shopping probably two or three days before I posted that haul. So it's been right at two weeks and it was getting to the point to where we had one meat left and we made that last night. So, <laughs> um, I will specify whether the groceries are for us or for grandmother and yeah I think that's it Walmart Aldi I'll start with Walmart the lighting is a little better over here our light bulb blew up here and I didn't realize that until I got back last night from the grocery store oddly enough I bought light bulbs just not that weird little size I think there's something wrong with that one because it literally, I have to change it like every two weeks. So let's get started over here. Here is an overview of Walmart. Let's start over here. Um, paper bowls, large paper plates, and small paper plates. These are the big packs. I know paper plates are bad for the environment. Yes, I do at least recycle. I try not to use them, but most of these are gonna go to grandma's house. She is currently still living by herself, even though I go check on her all the time. Um, she honestly doesn't need to be standing for very long and washing dishes, so you do what you gotta do. In our home, we usually use, um, for Ireland, she uses her little plastic plate sets that I got in one of my first grocery hauls that I showed on here, and we use these if we're like in a hurry grabbing something to eat before we run out the door so we don't leave dishes. Just to explain that because I know I'm probably going to get some flack for that. I'm not a fan of paper plates. I understand they're bad for the environment. Let's get that covered. Okay. A nice little assorted chip bag for my daughter and my husband. And I'm also hoping to take my niece to Disney with us one day and my nephews to the beach one day before school starts if it ever stops raining in Florida. Again, Ireland and my niece for Disney Day. Everything is unicorn. Those will also go with school lunches for her because we still have two weeks left. Um, garlic teriyaki marinade and medium wing sauce because I want to make chicken wings. I was supposed to last night. Um, these chewable tums. This is like the Equate version. It's a smaller bottle, so I got that for my purse. And this because... For some reason i've been getting heartburn really bad lately and those do not have that nasty chalky taste water flavors for ireland and myself balsamic vinegar that is for one of grandma's recipes and we have hot country smoked sausage for um, breakfast burritos for my husband ground turkey grandma's recipe ground beef ours two things of shrimp one for grandma's one for ours sour cream the Great Value Ranch dressing. And then we have Viva paper towels, which are grandma's. And we have um, s'mores, coffee creamer, husband's request, uh, Cinnabon, because I saw that and it sounds delicious. Our favorite coffee, which we just put a splash of creamer in. And then pineapple orange juice to make with smoothies. Here we go. And then we have bananas. I went to Aldi first, of course, and I tried to get two of these, and of course they only had 
well they had two but the other one uh, was one of them was really gross so obviously I just bought one romaine lettuce for myself Velveeta cheese for grandma, chopped cauliflower, um, like cauliflower rice for us, peaches for a peach cobbler out of grandma's recipe book, a couple of Roma tomatoes for my salads, two of my favorite flavored waters, cotton candy crunch cereal for my husband, um, waffle bowls for Sundays, Gatorade for my husband. This is Sorry, I have tiny arms. Gluten-free pancake and waffle mix for myself. Vanilla ice cream for my husband. This box is upside down. Gogurt Dunkers. Cotton candy ice cream with little cookies. Obviously, that's for Miss Ireland, but I'm sure my husband will dip into those. Um, sharp cheddar cheese for our recipes. Original vanilla bean coconut cookies. They are gluten-free, so I wanted to try those. It's definitely not something I would buy all the time, though, because it was like four bucks for this, and it's four ounces. Um, Sugar-free chocolate chips. I can make myself some keto chocolate chip cookies or something. Um, Jif peanut butter for grandma. That's the only kind she'll eat. I buy mine from Aldi. Marshmallow topping and hot fudge. Those were my husband's requests with the vanilla ice cream and the waffle bowls. I don't think I mentioned back there is more of those king size gusher packs, also husband's request. And we have these adorable little shoes, unicorn on the bows. They were $17. Obviously, I, luckily Ireland has not seen her show and she's not really into that. She just wanted them because of unicorns. <laughs> um, Wonder white bread for grandma because all she can have is white bread. So I got her two loaves, one to put out, one for the freezer. Elbow macaroni and cheese, or elbow pasta for macaroni and cheese. Um, that is for a recipe for grandma from her cookbook. And the tricolor rotini is also for grandma. Um, gluten free shells and cheese for myself for lunch one day. Um, this is for grandma, the Tide Pods, grandma's um, fabric softener white vinegar because I'm going to be doing some food prep and I like to rinse my vegetables off in that. Uh, contact solution for myself, can of original Rotel, one of our recipes, um, ground mustard for one of grandma's recipes. Um, this is open because last night after we found the dogs we were hungry but didn't really feel like cooking so we made smoothies. Um, organic greens plus superfoods and multivitamins. It was actually really good, we couldn't even taste it. A large bag of mixed fruit. Um, again, that was open because we made smoothies last night. Um, blueberries, one of grandma's recipes, um, blueberry pancakes, large thing of broccoli florets, that's ours. My favorite skinny cow, simply amazing salted caramel pretzel, ice cream bars, um, a bag of food for grandma's dog, a bag of treats for ours, a bag of treats for hers, and another bag of the same food for grandma's dog. Mr. Flash, um, this for the Sundays, and then the air filter that our um, air conditioning guy recommended that we get, which is only like four bucks. The one I was buying, the like hypoallergen or whatever was like 16 bucks. That thing's only $4. So major score that they recommend that one. Um, canned cat food, he has plenty of dry food, but he needed more canned food. And I think I forgot batteries, our pencil sharpener in the classroom needed batteries and you know toys and everything always end up needing them. Um, a can of beef broth, light bulbs, and Ireland requested this so I told her when we go see Lion King on Sunday she can take those or some special occasion or something because you know I'm not too big on candy just once in a while is okay with me, so there's that. This is the Aldi side, and there's also, those dishes are clean, <laughs> and there's some over there. So we have toilet paper for us, toilet paper for Grandma. Grandma likes the Macintosh apples, we like the Gala and Pink Lady apples, and they didn't have any Pink Lady. Well, they had one bag and half of them were like mush, so Gala apples, 
a watermelon for us, a bag of green bell peppers, the other, it's supposed to be tri-colored, but uh, there's two reds and a yellow, and the other one had two yellows and a red. Um, two English cucumbers, one for her, one for us, and no, you can't really see that. Two English cucumbers. It's really dark in here. Two bags of red seedless grapes, one for us, one for her. Ireland's mandarin oranges. A thing of fresh broccoli for a keto broccoli salad that I'm going to make myself. Um, two things of strawberries, one for us, one for her. Two things of summer squash for grandma. Two things of green beans. We just learned that that's a vegetable that she can have. So I thought I'd make her something a little different. Um, croissants, again, these have been open because that's what Ireland wanted for breakfast this morning. Um, a thing of biscuits for grandma's recipe. Uh, baby carrots, Ireland snacks, and then 12 of those will be for one of grandma's recipes. Um, two things of chicken wings. If, if you like chicken wings and you don't have an instant pot, you are highly missing out. Chicken wings. What was it? Six dollars and ninety cents for three point one five pounds. That is awesome. Much cheaper than going out. Much, much easier in the instant pot. It takes like I want to say five minutes, and then five minutes to broil, so ten minutes to make some delicious wings. So good, and you can do it from frozen. It's only three minutes if they're thawed. Five minutes if they're frozen, if I remember correctly. Black Angus bacon and cheddar cheese burgers. Um, I'm gonna do these lettuce wrap for lunch. One of my favorite seasonings. I put this on everything and I was almost out. Roasted garlic and herb from Aldi. My husband got Ireland a little pack of these when they went on a little daddy-daughter date the other day. And she loved them and it was like two bucks at Aldi. It's got eight little tiny bags in it. So I told her she could have those for special treats chewy granola bars my husband and Ireland both like those fruity duos we have not seen these ones there before so I thought that would be a nice little change and then for me my favorite uh, vanilla elevation protein powder and then over here we have unsweetened vanilla and unsweetened original almond milk I actually got two of each of these I just only brought out one of each because I didn't think I was going to have enough room, but I guess I could have. Um, one of each for Grandma and one of each for myself. Whole milk for Ireland and my husband. Mozzarella cheese because you use this a lot in the keto diet. Neufchatel cheese. It's kind of like a low-fat um, cream cheese. And two pounds of unsalted butter because we use that in grandma's recipes and I think that is about it all right you guys that is it for the grocery haul um I know you were supposed to get a vlog today but you're getting a grocery haul instead so tomorrow instead of the grocery haul you will be getting a vlog I apologize for that my puppy kind of threw a wrench in those plans but we did end up finding him so that is at least the upside to it at midnight we found him um, he was quite a few streets away, but nevertheless, he was safe, unharmed, and just hanging out with some friends, I guess. So <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and put all this up. I thank you for hanging out with me and checking out this grocery haul. Give it a big thumbs up if you want to continue to see more. Subscribe if you haven't already, if you would like to. And we will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye, guys. Say you believe in your